That, you know, is it that they were manipulated into this or is it that... Congratulations and thank you for your time. Jilly and Diana both seemed like pawns to me. And I was wondering if that was a way that they united, if that was something you thought about. When we first started doing this, I had to answer the question to myself, do I think they had a falling in love or not? The uh, answer really came from a piece of CCTV footage of them at the back of the Ritz, in which uh, you see them for seven minutes before they leave to get into the car for the final moments, holding each other behind Diana's back with him and her nuzzling heads and the gentle caress on the arms. And from that tenderness, you conclude, I think, that there was a falling in love, right? And uh, as you begin to construct your sense of where is the fabric of their souls and their souls in relation to each other, you look, and one of the things, for example, that I did is gathered together as many of the photos as I could from that period, and what I did is just put them in chronological order. And when you do that, you begin to see these little details between the photos, and not the ones that sell newspapers like The Kiss, but the one where you see Dodie's hand against Diana's face, or her touching him, or the attentiveness of their gaze to each other, or, or the wildness that they have as they get out of a helicopter and they're clearly having fun, or whatever it is. And it's with that that you then search through, because I kind of look at what we did as an act of research in some way, right? We, it's the first time in the history of the Crown that you have those four episodes to stretch and really look at the micro detail of that time. And as a result, you will then watch it and kind of know, is it that they were manipulated into this? Or is it that, well, you know what, put them in the same space and surprise, surprise, something begins to happen, you know? Is it that uh, is the reason that they end up dying, is it just the paparazzi or is it it's that and it's also, you know, the driver and it's also the bodyguard situation and it's also the pressures and I don't know, is it this or is it that or is it not? And, you know, in some ways all that is brought intensely into the, into the portrayal for you to explore all of that. And I don't think there are any answers, but I think all of those elements are valid to be explored, right? However, nonetheless, there are things that tether you. And for me, their touch, the nature of their tenderness, that tethers me. And there's always so much shimmering, uh, you know, and it's never this one answer or that, and you flatten it and turn it 2D and it somehow becomes not real. You know, you need to keep all that ambiguity possibility alive. I thought you really captured him beautifully. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you very Thank much. You. Thank you.